everybody. In the previous video, we discussed about sound frequency of a human and how sound is exactly produced by a human. In this video, we're going to determine the frequency of a whistle made by a human. In fact, I'm going to blow a whistle and we're going to capture the frequency. So, how is a whistle produced by a human? You know, a whistle is produced by, you know, like creating uh, an opening, you know, between two waves and then blowing air through that opening. Now keep in mind, whistles are pure tones, meaning they are comprised of only one frequency, which is the dominant frequency. Now we're going to be using an app called Sound Meter, that you can see right here. You know, it's a good app to measure uh, the sound pressure level and the sound frequency. So now you can see the sound pressure level here is 57 decibel, and this is the sound frequency. Now what you can see here is a range of frequencies, or like a spectrum of frequencies, right from 50 hertz all the way up to 16,000 hertz. Now, one good thing about this app is like it actually, you know, like it tells you information about the dominant frequency and the dominant sound pressure level, which is a good thing because when I'm going to blow a whistle, you know, it is going to peak up right here because it's a pure tone and it is the dominant frequency. All right, let's get started. All right, so what we observed here, you know, the dominant frequency was around 1,600 hertz. So, you know, it is indeed the frequency of my whistle. Now, human whistles, you know, uh, they are in the range of like 1,000 to like 2,500 hertz. And you may have extreme cases, but it all depends on, you know, the lung capacity of the human, the shape of the diaphragm, how quickly the diaphragm is vibrating. All right, you can also, you know, measure your own frequency, you know, by whistling and you can use this app to determine the frequency. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, you know, have a nice day.